Welcome back to the program where this episode I'm taking a look at a hard cider. It's been a while since I've reviewed a cider here on the channel. And this here is one from the Cider Boys. This is their Imperial Strawberry. Now I've had the uh, Strawberry Magic uh, six, seven, eight months ago. And it was the first time I'd had it. And it was actually very, very good. One of the top ciders I, I've ever had, honestly. I love the Strawberry and the apple uh, mashup in that particular uh, cider. This here is just called Imperial Strawberry. I'm not sure if it's an Imperial version of that cider or if it's just something different. But anyhow, we got an 8% alcohol by volume cider right here. Uh, the back says, reach for the highest branch. Cider Boy's Cidery balances delicious apples and sweet strawberries with a little something extra. Uh, apple wine with natural flavors, gluten-free, uh, packed by Cider Boy, Stevens Point, uh, Wisconsin. And like I said, uh, just a strawberry, you know, strawberry uh, cider right there. So not, nothing really uh, more about it. You got that picture of an apple and a strawberry on there. So that kind of says it all, right? So you got some in the glass here. You can see that it has that uh, cider appearance to it. Definitely says cider. Uh, well carbonated. Right there. As far as the nose. It's just sweet, very sweet strawberry, apple. You know, you get that cider or wine nose uh, coming off of it. Very, you know, very prominent. Overall, it smells just kind of like a, you know, a strawberry, apple, um, you know, cider. So let's get a drink on it. Crisp. Uh, refreshing. Very well carbonated. So you get lots of strawberry, lots of apple. You can tell it's an imperial version of, um, you know, a cider because that just on the back end, you kind of get that alcohol, um, you know, kind of taste in the back of the mouth there. No burning or anything like that. It's 8%. Um, but you can tell it's, it's a little stronger than your typical cider. With that being said, it's not crazy. Um, on the booziness, therefore at 8% on a hot day, these things pulling them out of the cooler full of, uh, you know, tub full of ice or something like that, 8% could get, uh, get out of hand pretty quick for some people. Uh, me, I would definitely, um, this isn't something I could drink a lot of, uh, you know, it's just, it, it does come across, it's got that tart strawberry sweetness, you know, that, uh crisp apple flavor. I'm just not sure how many I could actually drink. I could down a couple of them, no problem on a hot day. But um, you had this before, uh, let me know what you think about it. And uh, remember, like, subscribe, comment, and uh, check me out on social media. And thanks for watching.